1978 marked the 25th year the Corvette since it been introduced. The most extensive redesign since 68 with a new fastback rear rear end styling featured a large rear window but not a hatchback. This design created change, created significantly more luggage space between the seats and a retracting cover was added for security and sun protection. In 1978 to commemorate the Indianapolis 500 Chevrolet built limited edition Corvette pace cars. Chevrolet decided to build one for each dealer, about 6,000, plus some extras. The final build quantity released by Chevrolet was 6,502. This particular car is a time capsule. It has 1,000, yes, 1,300 miles on it. It is a one owner car, and we do have a lot of the original documents to the car. Most people don't realize the pace car stickers that you're used to seeing actually did not come on the car. It was a dealer installed item. A true survivor quality car. The paint on the car is original. Yes, it is showing some of his age, but it has not been redone. This is how it was gotten from the factory. Wearing mirrored uh, mirror T-tops and that beautiful silver interior that is in great shape. Power windows, tilt telescoping wheel, cruise, Power locks, power windows. A truly iconic car. Cubic inch Chevrolet engine. Like most Corvettes, we were dealing with uh, some gas issues during the 70s, and the car has 107, or excuse me, 185 horsepower. Now, the car will get out of its own way. It is very comfortable to drive on the highway, no issues whatsoever. but she's definitely not gonna scare you with her speed. She's a beautiful car, a lot of fun to drive, great for shows, and a car like this with such low mileage, there's a lot of fun things you could do with the National Corvette Restoration Society, survivor class car, that kind of thing to really help, not only with value, but to have a lot of fun. As always, 770-605-2056, or email john at buyavet.net. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel, that way you get to see everything first. And we'll see you all out on the road.